Now, as we approach the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, Radio 2 is uniting with every radio station across the UK to play the Mental Health Minute. We're coming together for a moment of reflection to encourage us all to keep the conversation going on mental health. In a poem by writer and mental health activist Hussein Manawa, you're about to hear from Dame Shirley Bassey, Joanna Lumley, Charles Dance, David Beckham, Jesse Lingard, Anne-Marie, Jamie Oliver and the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. Together they have an important message that our mental health binds every single one of us together. It unites us, makes us inseparable. You're listening to Capital with Will Manning. And I've got something really important to share with you now. We're approaching the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, but it's still so important that we keep the conversation on mental health going. This is BBC Radio 4. As we approach the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, we're uniting with hundreds of radio stations across the UK to play the Mental Health Minute. But right now, we're going to join up with every other radio station in the UK for the Mental Health Minute. But before we do, let me appeal to you. Don't let this be permission to talk about how you really feel for just one week. Let's take a bit of this with us. Let's think about this every day every week. So that was the Mental Health Minute. And just another reminder that if you are finding things difficult, you're not alone. So please do reach out to us at Kiss FM UK. You can find useful links on our website as well. We are approaching the end of Mental Health Awareness Week here on BBC Radio Leeds and we are uniting with radio stations across the UK to have a Mental Health Minute. We're coming together for a moment of reflection. I love that line that said our mental health binds every single one of us together. It unites us and makes us inseparable. I love that. Because it is basically what makes us human. Now we're joining with radio stations across the UK to talk about the importance of mental health and listening to each other. This is the Mental Health Minute. I want to talk to you about something different today. As we approach the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, Radio 1 is uniting with every radio station across the UK to play the Mental Health Minute. As we approach the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, Heart is now joining stations across global for a special Mental Health Minute. Now we're joining radio stations across the UK to talk about the importance of mental health and listening to each other. As we approach then the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, BBC Radio Wales is uniting with every radio station across the UK. Nearly one minute to eleven. Right now we are uniting with every radio station in the UK for an important message. Here is this year's Mental Health Minute. Classic FM. Now, as we approach the end of Mental Health Awareness Week, Classic FM is now joining stations for a special Mental Health Minute. Now we're joining with radio stations across the UK to talk about the importance of mental health and listening to each other. LBC is now joining stations for a special Mental Health Minute. In a poem written by the writer and mental health activist Hussein Manawa, you're about to hear from Dame Shirley Bassey, Joanna Lumley... As part of Mental Health Awareness Week, radio stations across the UK are joining together for the Mental Health Minute. We're approaching the end of what's been Mental Health Awareness Week, a week that reminds us that it's okay to talk about mental health. If there's one thing that's changed in our lifetime, it's the fact that people are more open about those conversations.